Welcome to Cinerapolis Foreskin of Soda and the Rowdy Bloodstained Thunderdome. The fans have already moved on from drinking beer in cheap plastic cups to drinking ale and freshly harvested skulls. I, for one, am glad the broadcaster's booth is an old World War III bunker. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Nashville Lycans take on the Purple Mutant Eaters. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I get totally shit-faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. And it's first and ten. <laughs> And he's running like a moose right. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in it. You know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. I mean, and anything really tastes good. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a, uh... <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. <laughs> Third down, and the punter is warming up. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say in the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? Yeah, well, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And it's first and ten. The Roid Rage dirty trick transforms a player into a rent, and he was steering a pick six but dropped the interception. And it's why he's a defense, schmuck. Second down and ten. and stumbling he could go all the way catch the ball get the first down and don't die see it's really a ref that just called that penalty he was convicted of marrying old ladies and stealing their savings that sounds like a good job he's right at home here taking money from coaches players and fans i even saw him swiping money from the bathroom attendant yeah who knows do that Slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Well, it's a fit. And that's a pick. And now the quarterback is cursing the deep. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. Oh, 
Second down and a lot. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run. Oh, man, I'd rather watch my big toenail being removed by a weasel than watch this. That's how I got rid of my toenail foot fungus, Grim. Found this weasel on the internet that did it for a can of sardines. Cheap. It pays to be smart when it comes to medical procedures. Well, the offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. With the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schlong Galaxy phone. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to fluff it, Grim. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. <laughs> more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. That'll be second down and four. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, I'm going in circles. It should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It's good. <laughs> uh, 
The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And it breaks away. Looks like a pass. And, ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Second down in a very lot. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Third down and long. really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Man, what a hit that was. And it's first and ten. And they stack the line and he gets his bell rung for a yard. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. Second down and nine. <laughs> Boom to the moon. Oh, that'll trim your nostril hairs once and for all. First and ten. The lineman swants the ball away with those meaty paws. Well, it looks so snugly. Yeah, I guess if you're a monster. Second down and ten. Oh, with the brutal hit. That, my friends, was an all pro. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. First and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. First and ten. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. <laughs> 
First down and a mile. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have a oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And it's first and ten. And the QB is running with a crazy pass. Look at the pass he's taking him. Touchdown! See that little baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. Man, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And whoever said never hit a man when he's down is just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. First and ten. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. And it's first and ten. It's a two-yard pass play, and that's not going to get it done. The offense needs to move the ball upfield. And that'll be second and eight to go. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. He's more of a downers guy than a speed freak, Grim. He's running from his team to his lair. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And the kicker just bit the dust on that play. Someone will have to come off the bench to replace him. And it's first and ten. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. That's the way to keep the chains moving. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. Well, fee fi fo fo The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. Oh, I love the murder ball, Daddy. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. The coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh his head just exploded. Let miss, let miss. Ah, oh, shit.
first. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And the ref somehow escapes the onslaught. Here comes the penalty. First down and forever. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. Oh, sweet mother of fornicating monkeys! He was destroyed on that play! Uh, that's a very weird expression, Grim. You ever been to the monkey house at the zoo, partner? Disturbing to say the least. Just like this. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Second down in a lot. was stuck to him like glue. Third down and the punter is warming up. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. He boomed that one. Let's see if they... He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Boom! And it's first and ten. Trick. That'll wake you up and then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Unless you're in a sleeping. The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And they quickly call a timeout to stop the clock. And it's first and ten. <laughs> And that pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And that'll be second down and four. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. That's it. That's their last time out. It's them against the other team and the clock. Well, that doesn't seem fair. I'm going to throw a hammer on the field and even the odds. <laughs> 
second down and more than the QB would like. And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8, the greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Where? The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense one yard gain on that pass play. Hey, look at the coach. He's picking his nose. You know, they shouldn't put that on the jumbotron. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. Yeah, for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. They've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. He did it. He scores. And with that amazing run, he bursts through the end zone for six. here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just gimmies the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing but their team has a chance to respond With the, with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schlong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum. At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsanto Industries, makers of great killer products like Ground Up. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. We're back for the second half in a blowout. The teams line up for the kickoff. Well, the game is this close as the score indicates. <laughs> The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a possession. Stealing ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback throws another pick. He should know, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe off the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. Gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Grim, what if interceptions come? Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. Whoa, oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play.
interception. This he could go all the way. And the defense is on his heels. First and ten. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. This defender is not going to be stopped. Once he picked up that loose ball, he was going to score or die trying. Luckily for him, he scores! <laughs> Turner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They just be... It's good! When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. Oh, what a brutal hit! First and ten. Second down and ten. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast hammer sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Wow! It's like a blood mobile crashing into a slaughterhouse. And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. And 
and it's first and ten. The defense had enough with this rep and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And that's how you get your buzz on in the NFL. Dad, I'm two fifths into this bottle of scotch. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. First down of seven. Perfect pass and the score! Oh, and the fans really loving his dancing out there, but they need to be careful. One drop of blood gets on them, they can kiss their skin goodbye. It shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. Well, I personally think the ginormous guy is compensating. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, it probably is. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. point attempt the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just gimmies let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty whichever First and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Second down and ten. Uh, come on, man. You got to catch that. I don't catch anything, Rip. I'm retired. Third down and ten. Boom! And like the Titanic hit. You know, you gotta put the buzz so on the MVP conversation breaks. Got more kills than anyone in the league right now. Yeah, you make a good point. <laughs> The offense is down to their 
last two linemen. Once they're gone, it's game over. Yeah, who cares? Linemen suck. They don't even deliver any fantasy points. They, they spend two years in the league and then they become bouncers and bite the bars. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. I don't know whose eyes the QB is. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And it's first and ten. <laughs> a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. Second down in a mile. Good throw, good catch, but not quite good enough at nine yards. Third down and, well, good luck. Great catch for a big game. But still not enough for a first. Even I'm frustrated, and I'm a team agnostic. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. See it. At least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Come on, man, you can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? Second down and more than the QB would like. And that is a big gain. You know the defense wants some payback after that. That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell in here. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. At this rate, well, that'll trim your nostril hairs once and for all. The offense is down to their final lineman, so he'll be playing center for the rest of the game. How's he going to be able to block all those defenders by himself, Grim? Well, he can't, which is why the QB is going to have to get rid of the ball very, very fast if he wants to stay alive. And it's first and ten. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 
Second down in a lot. Oh, man, talk about running into a buzzsaw, Bricks. Okay, he just ran into a buzzsaw. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Lucky find his head. He'll be okay. <laughs> Shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And it's first and ten. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole, up here. Talking to you. over 40 yards are difficult. He's going to really have to boom this one. The kick is good. Uh, as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story. Here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals a hurry up. Yeah, same as Bridges' ex-girlfriend signal. I don't know whose eyes it And that mutant just about met his maker on that hit. I thought he was made in China. I don't see any Chinese guys down there. You're a fucking moron. And it's first and ten. Point. And a well-placed cleat. <laughs> In a hurry-up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Second down in a very lot. And they just smacked that one back in his face. 
And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. Man, this coach, the quarterback doesn't like what he sees and calls a timeout. If I did that when I was in the bathroom, I'd never come out. I don't know. He's become self-aware, like a three-year-old. And he got it off. That's a decent pump. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, going in circles. The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. He could, oh, and he just made a nice cut to avoid the saw. But the saw just made a better, cleaner cut to the ball carrier. Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. And it's first and ten. Oh my gosh! The defensive player looks like he's lost his mind! Now that's just the berserker rate. He had it for a second there. Second down and ten. He broke free and has open field in front of him. Here comes the defense. Hey man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. He picks up eight yards on that pass. Second down and two. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the, the funeral expenses, that is. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up off. Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I top off my drink. Grab me a scotch while you're up. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up, too? Grim, did I kill him? A man from prison just came out of the field. It's the ref, idiot. Oh. Let's see what the penalty is. <laughs> The offense is down to their last quarterback. If they lose him, they lose the game. Second down and six. Does the Q 
you need know which. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your aunt. Br hey, yeah, Bricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. And the corner, it's a jailbreak. And the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Ho oh, ho, crowd's loving it. And the defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. The quarterback goes into a hurry up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Second, the quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. When in a hurry up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Uh, uh, can I get a Swiss on rye with uh, no mustard? He's at the 40. The 30. He's at the 20. The 10. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. Quarterback lucky for them, they're on defense now, or the game would be over. Uh, so, all the other teammates should do is punt the force of forfeit. That would be correct, Bricks. <laughs> well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, I don't know what How about if you not. shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. <laughs> Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right.